My start date here with First Dakota was January 2013. I was, I think, 38 weeks pregnant. Our management team had announced that we had a mandatory evening meeting. I remember we were all sitting in this room wondering, oh my gosh, what is going on? And these guys walk in with very tailored suits. We are doing an acquisition with the bank, the Bank 360 that we were at, and we're gonna be part of the First Dakota team. At first it was scary for sure. Um, a lot of unknowns, um, especially with me being pregnant um, and scared, And but it's been so great. And I am so thankful for First Dakota and everything that they've done for me. Their culture was a little different and I think they really thought it was refreshing to come over to First Dakota. We were all about um, empowering them to make decisions. It's just been great to, to work and grow beside her because yes, she started out as my supervisor, but then we totally learned First Dakota together. I think back of where I was to where I am today and it's because of First Dakota. You know, hobbies, you know, it kind of changes now that my kids are getting older. Of course, they're kind of the big part of what I do after hours. Um, they're getting very involved with things, and so that's fun. I'm getting to meet new people. Macy's an awesome mom. Uh, her kids are her world. I know after she broke her arm, she was still coaching her daughter's softball that summer which probably wasn't supposed to be happening, but she took her arm brace off and she was a coach. <laughs> I mean, that is probably the, her top priority is her family, her kids and her husband. Um, and that and her three dogs uh, are very important to her. Unfortunately, a Chicago Bears fan. You know, she's a big Bears fan for some reason, big Chicago Bears fan. So I wore this, my victory Vikings tie uh, perfectly today. I grew up in a sports family and um, I kind of converted my husband to be a football guy. So uh, we enjoy doing that together as a family. Fridays we get to wear red because she loves USD so much. Red on Fridays, she always wears red on Fridays. I don't know that I've seen her not in red on a Friday. Being part of USD and Go Yotes, um, that's been really fun for all of us too. Macy is very peppy, very bubbly, always has her office door open and wants us to come to her with concerns, questions, or just to tell us about, you know, tell her about our day. Macy is definitely your cheerleader, that she's always somebody that's gonna have your back. You can go to her for anything. We call her the cheerleader sometimes because she's always getting people excited, ready for work, and if we're having a blah day, she'll pick us up and say, we got this, let's go. Quintessential cheerleader, team effort, um, even things we don't want to do. Somehow she <laughs> figures out how to get us to do it and on the back side of that, um, it actually was better for everybody. We had a ladies retreat at a hunting lodge and of course there was a little wine involved and games and it was just so fun. Occasionally it is, is a, a nice treat to just kind of unwind and also to just kind of interact and get, get to know people a little bit more on a personal level. You know, First Dakota, there's so much more than a bank. You know, they really do value their people and just allowing us to do these activities outside of the bank and get to know each other more on a personal level so valued and important and there's we're not just a bunch of boring bankers I guess so we do like to have fun